my 50% off flash sale Criterion haul finally came in. Um, it's a mini haul, so don't get too excited. Uh, don't start salivating just yet. It's not that big, you know, but it's something. So I hope you guys enjoy my little haul here. Um, I haven't even opened the package yet, so I'm going to go ahead and open that up. Um, let me set the camera down here. Let's see. What's a good? That's that's a good angle, right? Yeah. So y'all can look at y'all can watch me tear into it like a like a barbarian. All right. All right. So the first one on the top here is Watership Down. Um, I actually watched this film for the Discord chat recommendation, um, which if you guys would love to be a part of, I would love that as well. Um, it's just $5 on my Patreon, and I will give you the Discord link, and you can chat it up whenever you want. Every other Saturday, we actually have a voice call chat, which is really awesome. Some of the best shit that's ever happened in my life, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, Watership Down, excellent film. I really enjoyed this film quite a bit. Um, I've heard about it for years. I just never got around to watching it. But, um, yeah, after watching the film for the Discord chat, I obviously felt the need to buy this. It's basically a 70s social satire kind of film that, through the lives of these rabbits, um, kind of explores a lot of societal themes and philosophical themes and things of that nature. But, um, yeah, really, it's a pretty disturbing film, especially for an animated film. Uh, I wouldn't really recommend watching this with your kids or anything, even though it's rated PG. Um, but yeah, I'll, let me let me move on to the next thing. So, Watership Down. The next one is... The Royal Tenenbaums. Um, written and directed by Wes Anderson, obviously. Um, I haven't really talked about this film at all on the channel. Um, I've obviously seen this years ago. Um, I think the last time I saw it was at least last year. Uh, this is a Wes Anderson film that a lot of people don't really talk about, and I think it's really great. I mean, I've never seen a Wes Anderson film that I didn't like yet, and I've seen almost all of them, so... But, yeah, The Royal Tenenbaums, obviously excellent cast, excellent writing and directing, um, really wholesome type of film that also probably has one of the best scenes that I've ever seen in a Wes Anderson film. Um, it's that scene involving Luke Wilson, for those who've seen it, you guys know, but absolutely love that scene and just the way it's edited and put together. Um, either way, I'm really happy to get this um, and add it to my Wes Anderson collection. I think on Criterion, I own Life Aquatic, World Tenenbaums, the, D the Darjeeling Limited, which I still haven't seen yet, and all the other Wes Anderson films I own just like on normal Blu-ray. But one of these days, when I, r when I run out of Criterion to buy, I'll, I'll rebuy them, but I don't know when the hell that's going to be. All right, next one. Children of Paradise. So, I'm not sure how many of you out there have either heard of this film or seen it, but I swear to you, this is one of the best films ever made. Um, considering that it was made in the 40s, let me see. Uh, what does it say here? It says it here on the spine. 1945. Um, it's a 1945 French film. That this 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 isn't a new wave film. This is like before the new wave, but. Um, I swear, just like, the way that this film demonstrates its themes through its characters and story is just, it's absolutely brilliant. And obviously the characters are great. I actually have a scene analysis for this film on the channel. I'll probably put it at the end of this video, like as a clickable little square link thing, whatever you call them. Um, and you guys can check it out if you'd like. I made that for a college project, and I aced the hell out of it. I think I got like a like a 95 or 100 either way it was like a, it was an a plus so if you guys want to check that out go ahead but i wouldn't really recommend checking it out until watching the movie so watch the movie first if you and unless you don't give a shit about spoilers and you know do, do, do whatever the hell you want so this is my haul um looks quite beautiful this is kino beauty right here guys um anyways thanks for watching um if any of y'all got your own little mini haul or a big haul I would love to hear what you got in the comment section. And if you really enjoy this video, as always, please make sure to give it that oh, that like and share it amongst your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more female. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more film-related content. Mm -hmm.